Is there anything better than a clean kitchen? Actually, I need to put a trash bag in. Starting a new vlog. It's Thursday night, September 26th. Tomorrow's payday. It's Friday um, tomorrow, but I feel like it's kind of like the weekend because I work from home. But I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea. Today was a really long day, but it was fun and it was relaxing. I got a lot of work done at work. Um, my husband was remote, so it helped a lot that he was home with me so I could get a ton of work done. And we went to Barnes and Noble. I just, I cooked dinner so I didn't spend any money on like Uber Eats and things like that. I got a little Starbucks treat for breakfast, lunch which wasn't much money. And then now we're gonna watch like 40 minutes of an episode, maybe less, like maybe 30 minutes because my husband's probably really tired. And then tomorrow morning I'm waking up early, well, hoping to wake up by like 5.45. I am not gonna try to like force myself because I still have a long, like a work day ahead of me. And I want to get like a ton of desserts tomorrow night and maybe do some baked goods i'm not sure i might do that um and then like watch movies all night so i definitely want to be alert and awake uh so but i do want to get a good workout in because they didn't work out today but yesterday i did a really good workout so tomorrow we're gonna run and hopefully you guys will keep me accountable and you'll be seeing that clip coming up. I'm gonna pick out a mug because I want to have some tea. I think we'll just do this little one. I've got a really cute Ray Dunn mug coming guys. baby at like 5 20 and then i just kept staying up and i really wanted to go back to sleep because i didn't even i didn't fall asleep till like midnight because i was rotting so no uh, my husband left for work like 10 15 minutes ago so there's just no excuse I'm wearing i want to show you guys I mean, it's just my home gym so i don't really like up but I bought these I guess they're similar to little lemon alliance but Amazon and they're in this like grayish uh, light gray white whatever I forgot the color but I'll link it below it's from Amazon it's amazing quality it fits so well it's not too tight but it's very snug and then this little paint splatter black and white tank is from Lululemon. And yeah, I need to go work out these giant non-muscular arms. 6.37, so I need to hurry. Can put this ambiance on for me? So cute. He always puts on like a different cozy autumn mod meons before he leaves. I love that. That's all I want. I just want like beautiful autumn trees. Java Bane. He's over there. Chilling. He just had zoomies. And then I just light my candles like in the morning and then in the evening for just a little bit. And I have the window open. Because I know these are technically kind of bad for you.
No, Daddy changed your diaper already. Ugh. So, first thing I do in the morning is I do her nose booger clear out because she has, it's Colorado and there's a lot of boogers in our noses. So we do that for her, or I do that for her. And then I have already washed her face with a warm towel and I kind of wipe up any milk dribble, things like that. Give her a little like gum cleaning with a little soft rag. Put the lotion on. Ain't a good girl. Okay, and then I'm gonna put her in this onesie here. Uh, my husband changed her diaper at 5.30. Let's see if she went again. All done. I'm gonna put the binky in the wash. Let's see if this smells bad. It doesn't like smell bad, so I'm gonna keep this because it's still clean. She only wore it once, so there's no spit up on it either. Good girl. Nice mama. This dancing crowd is genius. Do you want to play on your piano after? Do you want to play on your piano after? So, set up here. does about 15 minutes in the morning. <laughs> Guys, I'm losing it. Holding baby and making some coffee. I got this gifted to me, this espresso machine. And I'm honestly like, I really like it actually. And it matches my house really well. But it's, I want a different one though. I'm trying for the first time this Bianco Dapio. Let me know how you guys like this. I got it in a three set. I usually always have Bianco Forte and stuff, but yeah, so she's. A little Velcro-y, so I'm going to, hmm, what mug should I use? I'm gonna use my Switzerland mug. I've got a new mug coming, I'm so excited to use it, and I'll show you guys, but I'm gonna use this Zurich mug, because I love it. But you know what, at least she gave me time to shower. Maybe not talk right in front of the coffee machine while that's going. But yeah, I have some work that's come up, so I need to work on it. Um, I'm gonna change, she just fed, I'm gonna change her diaper, and then she should go back down in like 30 minutes or so. We got a lot to do today now, because like the chores are starting to pile up. Just a lot of like laundry, organizing, um, some dishes. And then we're gonna groom Java Bean later once my husband gets home. I think he's coming home soon and then he'll work from home the rest of the day. But yeah, so I'm gonna maybe put her in the carrier after I change her diaper and um, I think she'll be ready for sleep. Also guys, I wanna show you something. show you guys got this it's coming in the mail just said it shipped right here I got this color because there it is got this it's coming in the mail it's like a gray and white and I'm so excited to use it and I'm hoping 
it's worth it and uh, she'll like the uh, carrier better because the one I have from Ur Girl Baby is not good and honestly I I don't think it's good at all so um, I'm hoping this investment is just gonna pay off and this is the one I go is my go-to and it's gonna match a lot of things and I think like if I get pregnant with a second baby I want to get like a more like pretty design there was this cashmere like suede one or something and that cost like $750 but I was like no that's a little much like this was already like painful to pay for but it gives you 10% off on your first order and it was total of like $365 it's kind of nice I mean it wasn't nice but at least I got 10% off but yeah I have a lot to do kind of I was really impressed with that Amazon dupe for the Aligns this morning. It's the first time I've worn them. And then, yeah, I need to, I need to put her in the carrier and get to work now. You know the days where you're like, oh, it's going to be a chill day at work. It's Friday. This is no meetings. One of my team members, I'm a team lead, and she is just really struggling. My, this is literally my little bag collection. That's it. Oh wait, no. I have another bag too, but I'm gonna take, I think, this one. I kind of wanna take this, but I don't wanna transfer everything. I wasn't gonna vlog today, but I decided to, because why not? Let's see, what do I need in here? Maybe I need like a perfume. Baby girl sleeping on me. Guys, my arty pop is gonna arrive on Monday and you guys are gonna see it. Because I I do love this Argo baby, but I didn't get the right color, so it's just not happening. And then I'm gonna put in some perfume here. I'm really not into the fall perfume yet, guys. I'm gonna do the vacation scent. I'm gonna add this. Oh, yeah. Ignore my nails. They're already peeling off. I got my hand cream. Lossy Tane. I got some hand sanitizer right here. Pocket mirror. Her. Oh, she already has her bank. Okay. See? Yeah, so. My coach wallet. Make sure I have my home goods credit card. Yes, I do. Oh, and my Barnes and Noble. I need to get that too. Okay. So I think that's it. And then I think a lippy. I have a lippy out there, so let's go get it. Well, sorry, lights are all turned off because we're literally leaving. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Jesus is in the back. So, that, and then I think we're gonna pick up some breakfast. I don't know where. He does, my husband doesn't like Starbucks, which I get it, it's like not that good for you, but I like Starbucks sandwiches. He doesn't want that, I don't think. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take this, add to the bag. We are leaving now. We're going to Barnes. I'm gonna try to find the Pumpkin Spice Cafe book. Cause I actually ordered it on Amazon and it's gonna be here like Wednesday and I'll just cancel it if I can find it. Cause I'd love to just have it in my possession. But we're gonna try out this other Barnes and Noble location. And then, but first we're going to McDonald's to get their coffee cause we love their coffee. And then at the Barnes and Noble they have a Starbucks cafe. Skeletons, I told you about her coming oh, up. Oh, really? Uh -huh. Okay. There's like these giant skeletons in someone's yard, my husband said. So we're gonna see these. We're starting Halloween early this year. Yeah. Oh my that? gosh. Okay, guys. The F is that? It's like their only decoration. It's so creepy. Well, detour. But yeah, so there's like a Barnes and Noble. It's a really nice day. It's 79 degrees, 10.30. Baby girl's gonna eat. We brought her bottle 
and it's good for like 20 minutes so then we're gonna feed her right when we get to Barnes and Noble in the parking lot and then put her in the carrier so she can like look around while we look for books so there might be Christmas stuff out which would be crazy I think we're gonna really do Christmas up really good because his parents are coming uh, my in-laws and they're gonna come for a week and spend time with us and baby and I think we're gonna like actually put some effort in to make it really cozy and maybe get a few other decorations like we have to go get our first ornament and I want to check out some like cool Christmas stores that are in Colorado I think there's one in Fort Collins that we're gonna do like a day trip to just to look like I'm not actually gonna buy a lot because we bought a ton over the last couple years and I'm not trying to be too excessive about it and especially because of the clutter with all the baby stuff it's just not in the cards but maybe in our next house we'll do it like really big like I want the really high ceilings for sure here you go what? some walking around money and some books <laughs> Yes! Book money! Yeah. <laughs> oh no! What the heck is this? Oh, sausage. Alright, time for Romy's lunch! We are in the parking lot. Lunch time. You go everywhere. Hey. <laughs> She's so happy. Yeah, so she had a big diaper, so we changed her in the back. Always have to have the diaper bag, guys. Always. And then her binky. And then, thank goodness, we just made this milk right before we left. Good girl. But our errands aren't gonna take a long time. So after this, we'll just go to Home Goods quick. And then she'll be good for like two and a half hours. Hi. Yeah, so she's been laughing a lot more, grabbing things, bringing it to her mouth. So between three and four months, that's what they should be doing. Just like grabbing stuff in front of them and like bringing it to their mouth and an assisted sitting. Also, um, just more laughing and cooing and like trying to talk. All right, we're going to do the fastest turbo speed Whole Foods haul. We just went to Whole Foods and I spent literally my entire paycheck. I'm not kidding on one week's worth of groceries, but yeah, I told my husband we are not eating out for the next 10 days. But if we can do that, I don't know. It's been a while since we did that, but anyway. Okay, some fun stuff I got. We got these Halloween cookies, such a scam, but they were 15 bucks. So we're gonna try some of this tonight. Some Whole Foods Market Crostini. Cause we're gonna drink a lot of tomato basil soup this week. Cauliflower florets for my salads and just a snack on. Two green onions. I'm trying out this fall leaves scent hand soap. Um, it has a very interesting smell, but I need something for the kitchen, so I thought that would be good. Okay, first bag done. A South San Francisco sourdough. This was six dollars. This is for uh, the ham and cheese panini sandwiches we're gonna make tonight with our tomato basil soup. We got this Zevia creamy root beer. Uh, poppy, the cherry limeade, and poppy orange. I wanted orange cream, but they didn't have it. So that's three. And then my husband got these um, apple cider house alcoholic drinks. It's a pack of six, and we got two. So this one is blackberry hard cider, and this one's tropical cosmic cider. Next up, we got some like pre-made 
sandwiches and salads. This one was Chipotle bacon chicken sandwich. Some tomatoes. We got a ton of tomatoes so we can make this soup. Some potato gnocchi for more soups. Um, vegetable broth for the tomato basil soup. It helps give it a little more flavor. And I got two low sodium organic chicken broths. Um, two green juices because I didn't really have time to find more. Another tomato basil soup. Babe, do you want to split one of these? Yes. yes, mocha cold brew. We're going to split one right now because I'm so thirsty. I mean, no, not thirsty, tired. See, exactly, I'm tired. Oh, that's good. Here, yeah, it's oat milk latte. I did not see it was oat milk. Shoot. Okay, well, I got three more. So these will be just easy to grab in the fridge. Mocha cold brew. I want to change my almond milk out because I realized all the almond milks that I've been using and creamers have like gums and all these additives that I am not here for. So got almond milk, organic pumpkin spice, and it's all mu almond milk. So that's fun for the holidays. Romaine. More tomatoes. Organic raspberries. Organic strawberries. More Campari tomatoes. That's really good for the tomato soup. Mandarins. Whole bunch of cheese. And we got some salami. Just a munch on with the costini things we got. Mild cheddar slices. Light string cheese. And then we got this cool organic pumpkin spice cinnamon rolls. I'm going to have my husband make those. One of these nights. Maybe for Wednesday. Like a little pick-me-up. Ground beef. Then heavy whipping cream. For the basil soups, uh, some Vital Farms unsalted butter. We're out of butter. I got these uh, garlic charred seashells. I thought I would try this pasta one of these nights. I could throw it in a soup too. Then hickory smoked cheddar cheese. Caesar grilled chicken wrap. Toothpaste, we are fresh out of toothpaste. Mild cheddar. Gosh, this is the biggest grocery haul. Okay, basil, parmesan cheese, Clarina village cheese, original Gouda cheese for my husband to munch on. It's for charcuterie, but I don't eat Gouda, but yeah. I'll do parmesan though. Beef sirloin flap steak for our cream barbecue night. So I am gonna go put this in the fridge like ASAP. Look at this monstrosity, guys. I need to go into turbo speed because this is, this is unacceptable. Sunday guys, just made Korean barbecue for lunch. Just set it up on the island because I'm not trying to get it all over the dining table. But I got some steak from Whole Foods yesterday. I think it's like called like the flank part of it, but it's really good and it's our, it's really easy to cut up and that's what I use because I don't eat well, I didn't have pork belly, so that would have been tastier, but this is just as good. There's my green onion salad. And look at the boys. And baby girl sleeping in the room. My husband is missing out right now. Good morning from Colorado. Today is Tuesday. And my 
Busy season is finally over. I'm feeling very hungry right now. Um, she just fed, it's 9.30. So I'm just kind of working a little bit, but also just doing some chores. And yeah, so I wanna cook some breakfast. I really wanted to fast, you know, but uh, I'm really hungry. I am, let me show you guys. It's like a balmy, like 50 degrees outside. It's amazing. And then Java's sitting by the fire. And work is going good. It is super chill this week, so I am very happy. Housemate is watching, just started this book. Also started a different book as well, but I'm switching in between both so that I can get them done because this one is gonna go super fast. I know it. It's already so good if you haven't read this series uh definitely try and it's been highly recommended by many many people and we've got my atona formula and i think i'm gonna cook some like scrambled eggs with rice because i already have a pot of rice going Open up this package. I've got a lot of stuff coming in. I think my new carrier is coming in today, so you will not be seeing this one anymore. One, two, third one, four. I threw that away, so let's have a little chit chat now. I want to put her down on her bed. I was like, well, we're going to install like the little railings, but yeah, she's already going to a floor bed because she's been co-sleeping with us and now she's moved to the like right next to my bedside and it's really working well for us guys. So yeah, so this is her first nap of the day. She's been up since like 7.15. So she's been up over two hours and I think it's good and she's not overtired. She's just learning to stay up longer. Um, we did tummy time, she played on her Montessori play gym, then she loves looking at Vampire Cat, and it's this like Squishmallow, it's so cute. I think it's because of the high contrast colors. So she looks at that, she like plays with her rainbow fish, you know, her rattles, and um, just like, right now it's really important for her to grab things and like bring it to her mouth to explore. So I keep everything washed and uh, clean. But yeah, she's doing great. So last night, show you guys what I ordered last night. I realized I don't have any kind of off-white dresses for her baptism. That's coming up very soon here. So I decided to order this. It's by it's from Nordstrom. It's called the Bell Swiss Dot Tule Tiered Maxi Dress from Petal and Pup. So I got this right here. can see it but it's like really feathered and really like dainty looking so I'm gonna be wearing that for her baptism I might have like a little pullover but I thought it was really cute it was on sale for 80 bucks so it was a little expensive but I thought it was worth it to splurge for this big event for her um, a lot of family are coming in from and her our friends are gonna be her godparents so they're gonna be facetiming in and speaking of like a big event coming up i want to lose five pounds before then so i have about two three weeks and honestly i know that sounds like a lot of weight but it's mostly like bloated water weight because i have not been really like watching what i eat besides like not eating out i don't watch too much what i eat i, I ran yesterday i'm gonna walk today we're gonna do a family like one hour walk later um java will go for as long as he can then we'll bring him back and then keep walking and it's like really nice out it's like a fall sunny day and it's that's the best when it's like crispy and like it's cold crispy like it's not fried chicken um it's crisp outside and it's cold but the sun's shining 
that's seriously the best so i got that and i need to order heels but i don't know what heels to get i'm looking at like steve madden but i want a nice like neutral heel i think i don't want white i'm gonna make some eggs now she's falling asleep Such a sweetheart. We are gonna go for a little lunch walk. She just fed for the second time today this morning. So it is now almost 12, so I'm taking my lunch and I'm gonna walk with her as long as I can. And then I'm gonna hang out in the backyard for a little bit, get some sun. And it's a little bit cool, so she'll be perfect in this onesie. And then I have her little bucket hat. For you new moms, if you want to go outside, but you know that they can't get sunlight until they're seven or until they're six months old, then you should guys should get this little bucket hat. They have a ton on Amazon. So it's going to just rest right on her so she doesn't get any direct sunlight. Carrier is on, but my Artie Pop carrier comes in today. I don't think I'm gonna include it in this vlog, but I'll show you guys in the next vlog that I'm gonna start filming today. But I wanted to end the vlog today. Today's October 3rd, uh, it's 11 a.m. And I had my meeting this morning, got a ton of work done. Um, Romy is in her assisted chair, activity chair, and she's seat belted in. I can see her. She's looking at her books and stuff, and then I'm about to feed her, and then put her in the carrier to contact nap her. Before I close out, a couple things came in. I got an or a package from Anthropology, and my Nordstrom Pop and Pedal package came in. So, it looks like this. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of what it looks like. Let me just quickly. Holy cow, this is like a serious dress. It's so cute though. Anyway, yeah, that definitely will fit. It's massive. But yeah, it's actually, I thought it was off white, but it's white. Interesting. But I love it. It's really like frilly and girly and, and very church appropriate. Wow, good girl. 
So we'll do a try on in the next vlog, guys. So this is the package from Anthropology. I need to go ch like hang this white dress ASAP before it gets stained out here. So I got two packages. Can anyone guess what they are? I'm serious. Oh. I will link these below because you guys are going to die. Oh my gosh. It's a pumpkin like coffee mug. It's stunning. Like what? Are we kidding me? It's glass. It's super like a good size. It's a very good size and I can put plenty of coffee in. I'm definitely having my second cup of coffee in this today, but I got two of these to add to my cupboard collection. It's so stunning. I'm gonna get the second one opened. Here's the second one with a little like leaf detail. This is the, my favorite fall mug I've ordered this season. And a, there are two missing mugs that I need to go put in. But yes! Say hi, some mummies. Say hi, mama. Yeah, so it's about to be her second breakfast of the day. And I'm going to feed her now, but thank you so much for watching the vlog. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I'm excited for this next week's vlog. Hi, mommy. So yeah, she wants to feed, but yeah. All right, we'll see you guys next time. And have a good weekend. <laughs>